So you went to a show yesterday. Yep. Did you like it? Yep. I wish you said no. Of course you wish that upon me. You always want me to have a bad time, don't you? Yep. Okay. I'm going to go play now. Yep. Should do sound effects for the wind. That was sound effects for the wind. If you don't have sound effects for the wind, you should just make sound effects for the wind. There's a tip for you. So I went to a show yesterday. A nice, free, um, hardcore show. I thought it was uh, going to be punk music. What's the difference between punk and hardcore? Big difference. Big difference. I prefer uh, punk type music over hardcore. Hardcore just gets extremely fucking boring after a while, to be completely honest with you. I felt like I wanted to die how boring that shit was. It's just, I hate traditional musicians in general. They all sound the same. I don't understand what you can't even I don't know. I just think that shit is so corny after a while. What's the point? What's what's so great about um every band sounding exactly the same? And the progression in um in hardcore music is literally every single fucking every almost every song has that part in it. I'm like, oh. I don't think people actually go because they really like the bands, to be honest. They go just because they want to mosh. So in reality, a lot of people that go to these shows is for narcissistic reasons. Because <laughs> they think it's their show and they're like, yeah, man, yeah, that's mosh pit. Yeah, it's about us. Yeah, let me do a flip on someone's head. <sighs> Criminal Juice for the Blind. And yes, there's a lot more to talk about. Because <laughs> it's not just a lot of uh, things happened yesterday. So I'm happy that I actually went. But a few things happened. A few weird things, a few annoying things, a few really funny things. I'm going to talk about that, but criminal juice for the blind if your eyeballs don't work. I'm saying it out loud for you. For the deaf, sign language, and my beautiful lips moving up and down. And for those that actually have eyeballs that work, you know, eyeballs that actually work, you could look down here. And if you can't read that, you can let me know, and I'll teach you how to read on stream. Pretty simple. I'm going to get this pillow over here, which I'm really happy to be using. Because now I need it. Not only for the comforting support, but I need it because it's like... It, get, it, it's, it, it makes me warmer. Because believe it or not, finally, it's cold. It is cold. Finally. So, <laughs> I, can't be I can't believe it. <laughs> Unprofessionally to the dashboard we go. Let's see if uh, I'll have trouble again on Destiny 2, which is fucking annoying as hell. I remember playing yesterday and it disconnected a few times. It disconnected -y. And I wanted to... I don't know. Uh, I almost lost it. I think I disconnected like... Um, I don't know. Like about three fucking times. Like three goddamn times. That shit was so fucking annoying. I swear to God. Let's 
Let's see how good I do in multiplayer today. <laughs> I'll start off with actually throwing a, a energy shield right away so I can get... That's the only thing that I'm missing in this game. Making sure I have my, sh my shield as uh, strong as humanly possible. That's literally all I'm missing. My, my, feels fucking strange, baby. Baby. Let's see. Whew. Always gotta stretch the neck right in the morning. Always. Always hurts. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, I don't want to start off right away competitive. You know I got to go to quick play, which is way better. They have a lot more cooler shit to do there. A lot more fun shit. I hope it's the... I hope they throw me right into the soccer. The soccer shit. It's really corny, but it's fun at the same time. You got to collect soccer balls. <laughs> That's so stupid. But yeah, let's talk about the fucking show that I went to. So basically, it ended up being like a hardcore show or some shit like that. But it was a um, a fundraiser, I guess. I don't know if it's for the family of the guy who died or I don't know. But it's just some some lead singer of a of a band called the. Uh, Warzone. Warzone. And, uh, what a lame name for a band. But, uh, but maybe it wasn't lame back then, I guess. <laughs> I guess now it sounds lame and dated, but in reality, that band is like 20 something years old or something like that. I don't even know. But yeah, the, the lead singer died 20 years ago, I believe. And, uh, so they did another, I don't know, a fundraiser. I'm guessing it's for maybe his fam, his his uh, wife. Who knows what? Who the who fucking knows? I don't even know. But um, his name is Rabies. Get it, Ray? But Rabies, like Rabies. Anyways, a lot of hardcore people and punk people like to have names, like nicknames and shit. Some of them are corny, but that one is actually funny as fuck. Um, Alright. Oh shit, I didn't do what I said I was gonna do. <laughs> I gotta... <laughs> I gotta start off... With... Okay. <laughs> let me let me have my submachine gun. <clears throat> so yeah, it was like a fundraiser for this guy, Rabies. Oh my god, Rabies. And it was a lot, a lot of people. But it's a free show, so you can expect there to be like a good amount of people. They always have um, free shows at Tompkins Square Park. This was the last show of the e of the year because obviously it's go it's gonna be way too cold for them to perform. I say perform in the cold. Like, well, who gives a shit? I say perform in that cold. Right. Just wear gloves and cut out the fingers, and, and your hands will be warm when you, while you're playing guitar. But yeah, the bands were annoying. I got there on time. I got there right on time, right? Got me. He mu he must have shot me right in the fucking face, cause that he killed me right away. Um, 
what the fuck was I saying? Oh yeah, I got there early. I got my four burritos. <laughs> I got my four, <laughs> four Taco Bell burritos. And uh, oh yeah, let me talk about before I even got there. Yeah, let me just talk about the train ride because <laughs> this this actually pissed me off. Um, strength in numbers, Guardian. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> kind of hard to speak when you're. Trying to destroy people, you know? When you're trying to destroy people, <laughs> it's hard to speak. But yeah, the train ride. Let me get this fucking. Rest our glory. Glory is yours. Sorry, dude. Twitch right to the submachine gun. <laughs> You love it. Five minutes remaining. How to love it. Stronger as you fight. I love it. <laughs> Thank you so much for loving it. I'm loving it too. But yeah, I go on the train. Regular train ride. And then some extremely cute little girl comes up to me and I have to stop my music from playing and I'm like, oh hey, what 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 did you say? I didn't hear what she said. Uh, I just got killed. Anyways, she's like, and I'm like, taking off my earphones. I'm like, what? What are you saying? What do you say? What are you talking about? Let me see if I could go around and catch catch this fag. Get over here, baby. Okay. 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 Fuck! They're everywhere. But it's alright, 21 to, to 6. Anyways, and then she goes, Oh, would you like to buy one of my drawings or paintings? And I'm like, okay. And then automatically I'm like, I have $2 in my wallet. That's what I would expect someone to sell it for a dollar, two dollars. Then she's like, oh, I have paint. And I'm like, how much? And, she, and, I'm, and she's like, I have paintings for, for $10. I have paintings for $5. And I have paintings for three dollars, and in my mind I'm like, uh, okay, pretty expensive paintings, but whatever. So I, I was like, oh, I only have two dollars in cash, so, and and I just handed her the two dollars, and I'm like, here you go, you could just have it. I don't. I, I wanted one of her things, but you know, too rich for my blood, I guess. I did not. I don't carry cash around. I usually just use my card. Um, three minutes. Okay, they're fighting down there, but I just want to get this, this shield on before I go into battle. Yeah, I just kept running. So yeah, I just hand her the two bucks, but then I start thinking in my head, I'm like, okay, that's her piece of shit mom right there. Of course, it's a ghetto mother because I'm thinking to my head, okay... It's like, I'm on the train, it's like 1 o'clock or so. Okay, hold on. I just started getting pissed off in my head because I'm like, of course. Of course a ghetto ass bitch of a mother, and I'm sure she's a single mother. A stupid ghetto ass bitch, right? How the fuck do you have your little child? doing work for you on the train. I think that's just, just just pathetic in every single damn way. Just the thought of it. I don't know. I just it just bothered me. Just like it bothered them when I just took them out right now. I'm so happy I finally got a good uh <laughs> I finally used my superpower for good. But anyways, uh it just bothered me. You're using your little baby girl, which on a Sunday, you should be taking out your kids somewhere 
enjoyable spending time with them, but no, you have her working on the train around all these goddamn strings, going from train to train, selling her paintings. And it's funny because I looked at the mother and she had Jordans on, expensive Jordans. She had nice gear. Her kid didn't even have... She had on expensive clothes. Her kid had nice, cute clothing. But it's just funny. It, it's always like that. You always see the ghetto mom with expensive-ass clothing and you see the kid with cheap clothing. You always see that at the ghetto. It's the most disgusting thing in the world how they treat their children. And it just made me really sad because the girl was so sweet i, I i'm a hundred all the i'm sure she probably seconds. screams at her little girl and probably hits her and shit that's that's the ghetto community for you having their children sell shit for you and you're and you're perfectly fine and you're not working to feed your child give me a goddamn break that shit made me sick to my stomach i'm not even gonna lie I just felt bad when I saw that. I'm like, oh my gosh, she's like, what, five years old or something? Six years fucking old? And she's here on the train selling shit? Oh my god. Whatever. I still don't regret giving the money only because... Hopefully that money can go towards feeding her in some way, I don't know. That's... But most of the money is going to go to to her mother's weed and alcohol and and uh, expensive clothing like having Jordans and shit like that that's what the money's gonna probably go towards you know and I still have something that connects to this I just wanted to mention what happened and then alright I got off the train I go to Taco Bell cause I said oh, okay I already had four eggs in the morning four scrambled eggs in the morning and uh i go to uh i said okay i'm just gonna eat four burritos and i'm done for the day so i go to taco bell uh, and i'm online and, it, and the line takes forever and by the way my goodness don't you hate well you probably well uh, this is for the people that actually have good taste in music um, don't you hate going to fucking fast food places or whatever and, they, and the music they play is just the corniest music. It's either on Hot 97 or maybe 92.3. Obviously all you hear is the same sounding shitty fucking music. You know, the usual. The usual. You know exactly what I'm talking about. The music that sounds the same by an artist that nobody knows. Like a million artists but they're just like one hit wonders or whatever. I don't know. And what, well, what the fuck was the chorus that made me so pissed? It made me so, it just annoyed the shit out of me how uncreate. there's no creativity in the music that's put out. I think it was like, oh, in the chorus she literally was like, It's my party and I'll cry if I want to, cry if I want, I'm like, what, it, can people not create original choruses or something? Is it really that hard? Is it really as hard as Dark Donkulous Dick right now? Because he just joined the chat room. Like, seriously. It's my party and I'll cry if I want to. That song was made when? In the fucking 70s? I love when Dark Donkulous comes in the room. Because it says on the screen, your friend Dark Donkulous has joined, right? And then this with this stupid girl. So, <laughs> so specifically for Dart. Uh, a girl pops up for him. You know, Dart. I'm starting to think that's probably you. I that. You know what? You're 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 probably a British girl, and you don't wanna. You're just pretending to be a guy. Is that is that you? Just a just a just a simple question, Dart. Don't lie to me either. I think that's you, dude. That's you. You know what? I'm gonna say that that that's Dart. Uh, that's the image I'm gonna say in my head. Because I don't think you're ever going to show me a... Maybe you'll show me a picture of yourself one day, privately. So I could have something to jerk off to. But, um... Yeah, for now, I'm just going to have that image in my head. That that's exactly how you look. <laughs> just... I don't know. That's how you look in my mind. <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah, I, I went to Taco Bell... To get four burritos, whatever. Then I'm waiting on the line... 
some guy comes up to me and he's like, yeah, I hear that horrible song. Some guy literally comes up to me and goes, hey, hey man. I'm like, yeah, can, can you get me two tacos? I'm like, sure. What kind of tacos do you want? Because I don't like denying people food. Food is not a luxury in this world. That's one thing that, to me, clothing, material things, shit like that are are, are a luxury. But food is not a luxury, and I don't deny people food ever because it just I don't I just don't. Sorry, sorry to you know for you people that don't like to share you know food or buy anyone food and help people out. Sorry, but uh, I buy this guy some food. I'm sure he probably lives on the street and stuff. He looks like he has he's addicted to some sort of drug, maybe heroin, who knows. But I buy him two tacos and he's like, Yeah, yeah. Let me get a chicken and a bean. I'm like a chicken and a bean? No, and he's like, I mean beef. He wanted a chicken and a beef bur uh uh taco. And then I'm like and then I'm like, Alright, that's it, that's all And then he's like out of nowhere he's like And a chalupa <laughs> And I'm like, Okay, uh, Chalupa and then and then he he kind of felt bad in his head he was he's like no just two tacos he he felt like oh maybe I'm asking for too much and I'm like no dude I'll get you your your Chalupa don't worry I'll get you your Chalupa dude your Chalupa I want you to win the the Xbox X like uh, Dart wants to win the Xbox <laughs> so I got him a Chalupa or whatever the uh, whatever um I got him a damn chalupa, and uh, and there you go. Dart, Dart, Dart. I thought you were, I thought you were working and stuff. I'm surprised you're here, dude. What's up, Dart? I'll continue my story, but I want to talk to Dart for a bit. What's up, Dart? Let me guess. You're playing Ark, aren't you? Be honest, dude. You're probably playing Ark. Don't spend all that ammo in one place. And if you do not respond, I will continue in my... Oh, okay. So I'm guessing... I am guessing that you will be playing with me after this. Well, I'm not guessing. I am hoping that you will join me on uh, Left 4 Dead 2. Hopefully, yeah. Unless you have to fucking leave really fast like the other day. Oh yeah. Me and Dart. I wonder what the fuck we're gonna we're gonna conquer today. I think you know what, Dart, me and you, I know this it was difficult last time, but we should just give Dark Carnival a shot again. I don't know if you would like to do that. Or maybe you would like to play something else, but I think we should just give it a shot, dude. Give it a shot. Oh shit. Maybe we should give Dark Carnival a goddamn shot, man. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm so happy. I've been called Mr. Krabs before. Thank God there's there's such medication that will help you with that. To be completely honest, I've only had a, one problem with my penis that a female has given me. I do not know. She gave me a sort of a a infection or of sorts, but it wasn't nothing crazy. It was nothing crazy. It was just a bit itchy. And I had to get monostat and put it inside of my penis and yeah and then it cured it right away but that was that felt horrible and that's all I gotta say about that one <laughs> I don't know if you've ever had something wrong with your penis besides it not being in my mouth maybe that's a problem to you and I know you hate don't that when it's not in your mouth in one place. I mean in my mouth <laughs> but uh yeah have you ever had a problem with your penis? Dart? Oh, 
Traveling ahead. Keep it that way. Just a just a regular question, you know? Just regular questions we gotta ask. Nice and early in the day. What in the fuck are you doing, my friend? If you come back this way, that grenade will be waiting for you, dude. Holy shit, what the fuck is going on over here, baby? Oh, huh, baby? Baby! Don't worry, I got my little shield here in case... Yeah, you wanted to come fight? <laughs> that took a while. Uh, don't pay attention to... Don't pay attention to where I'm at on the scoreboard. That's, uh, you, that doesn't mean anything if I... You know, it doesn't matter if you're in last place. So don't look at that. Uh, yeah. Fuck. I'm gonna wait right here. Fuck you, dude. What do you think? What do you think? That I don't have superpowers, my friend? Huh? I got superpowers, my friend. Superpowers, dude. Get the fuck out of here. Fucking pieces of shit, I swear. Oh shit, trying to run away. Yeah, it's not long enough, man. Yeah, it's two inch long, what do you want? <laughs> what the fuck do you want? That's why I made, that's why when people follow, oh, you're, oh, you're, I thought you were talking about mine, because obviously I make sure everybody knows I'm two inch long, okay? That's why when people follow me, the little thing on the side says two inch long, dude. I want everyone to understand. That's the only problem you have, man, that it's not long enough. The funny part is, for me, it is, because think about it. My butthole is pretty tight, so, okay, I hope nobody saw that. That was just pathetic. No thanks to me. A victory well executed. No thanks to me. Um, it doesn't bother me. To me, it's long enough because I'm a guy. So, it going in my butthole. And my butthole is tight, so... So, you have nothing to worry about. You have nothing to worry about. You're lucky that you're in a relationship with me. You're lucky that you, that you like girls and guys, dude. That's what saves you on that one. You know that? All you gotta do is just is go out with when it comes to female, just go out with an Asian girl. That's all. That's all I go out with, you know. You need an Asian girl, baby. They're used to that shit. When it's not long enough. So tell me, Mr. Uh, Dart Dunculus. I'm gonna no, you know what? I'm not gonna say Dunculus. Dark Dark Dunculus. Um How was your Sunday? How was it dude? I know you were crying tears. I know you missed me. As I missed you as well. While I was at the show, I was putting my hand in my pocket and uh yeah, I'm not gonna say anything else. But I was thinking about you when I was at the show. How was your Sunday? You let me know. Let me know. Let me know. How was your Sunday? Your Sunday. Um, you know what? You know what, Dart? Listen, buddy. I'm, I love details, okay? I like details. I don't like, I don't like small talk, all right? I don't like three word answers. It was good? No, dude. D tell me something. Supremacy. Like, did you eat a chalupa like you said you were gonna eat a chalupa? Tell me why, tell me why it was good. You gotta tell me at least one detail of your Sunday, dude. Come on. Come on. You gotta tell me something. Sorry for, sorry for being interested in your life. You know, it's just, a, it's just something. It's just a habit I have with people. You know, it's just, it's just a weird little habit I have where I just pay left for dead, left for dead too, and eat a lot of food. And that's what I love to hear. That's the type of details I want to hear, dude. And if you don't mind. What kind of food did you eat? Because I, I get jealous when 
I hear people eat a lot of food. I always like to wonder, because I'm a gigantic food fan. Maybe one day, when I meet you, because I feel like I'm going to meet you one day, um, maybe we can have an eating contest on uh, live. Because I'm also going to IRL, I'm going to do IRL one day. I don't just want to be a... I want to mainly be a game streamer, but I also want to get into uh, IRL as well. IRL is extremely interesting. I love it. Going on outside and meeting people and just... I don't know. Pretty cool. Pretty fucking cool. Right up my alley. Some roast beef, chicken, and pizza? What a... F <laughs> what a lucky bastard, dude. All I had was four bean and cheese rice burritos, man. I didn't have all that amazing shit like you did. Lucky, lucky, lucky guy over here. Lucky, good-looking feminine guy over here. You're the, you're the hottest guy I've ever seen. You look just like a girl. That shit is insane. I love it. Them to line up faster. Holy shit. And I feel now I'm thinking about Aaliyah. That has to be the worst fucking uh dart. What do you what the fuck what do you think is the worst death? Like you know, what do you think is the worst way to die, in your opinion? I believe the worst way to die is burning alive. That's what I believe. Out of everything in this world, I believe burning alive is the worst way to die. What do you What do you think is the worst fucking way, dude? Five minutes. Could go your way. Could go theirs. It's gonna go our way. So, how dare you say it could go their way? No, it's not gonna go. A stabbing? <laughs> I'll take a stabbing any day, dude. I don't give a fuck. He says stabbing is the worst way of dying. You're right. If the person continues, you, that shit is is horrible. I I I I prefer to get stabbed to death. To be honest, I I just think. First of all, sometimes when I cook something, just. Just, um, just a little burn hurts so much. So burning alive would have to be, but getting, imagine getting stabbed over and over and over. Not just one stab, because that's nowhere near as painful as burning alive, but I, I think, I think Dart is saying, like, getting stabbed over and over and over again. Uh, I've almost gotten I almost got stabbed um, well where is that right here is I don't know if you can where the hell is it right uh, here I don't even know if you can see that baby that is a scar on my arm right here it looks it looks a lot cuter in person so it's like a, a, a scar there. I've, I've actually gotten sliced before. Wonderful New York City, right? I've gotten jumped before as well. Only once I got jumped. Fortunate for me, it didn't really... I didn't really get any injuries or got hurt, really. I had too much adrenaline. It happened literally 10 seconds. I got jumped for like 10 seconds and it didn't. I literally got kicked in the goddamn head. And it didn't hurt for some odd reason. I guess when you have so much adrenaline, it's just like, okay, whatever. But that's that shit is fucking sick, the way Aaliyah died. That's just horror. Horror. I will be playing Left 4 Dead 2 in 20 minutes, just to let you know, Dart. Cause I don't want to. I don't know. I know you have your panties in a bunch. Don't worry, buddy. Twenty minutes. I always gotta do at least a good hour of um 
of destiny. We're pulling ahead. Keep it that way. Yeah, the way Aaliyah died is just horrific. Not only do you experience your your plane falling out of the goddamn sky, but it crashed. I hope that when it crashed that she died instantly. Cause that would suck if it crashes and you're still alive and then you die off of getting burned alive. That shit's crazy. I hate myself. What the fuck are you what why the hell are you saying you hate yourself? Why are you saying that, Dart? <laughs> because you ate too much or something? Why why do you hate yourself? I hope I hope you're kidding around too. Because it, it doesn't make sense for someone as cool as you to hate yourself, so... Please explain to me why you just wrote I hate myself. So I can tell you... So I can tell you why you shouldn't hate yourself. Uh, I, forgot, I forgot my health pack and needed it. Okay, good. I'm happy it's... it's it, you weren't being serious. Like that you actually really hate yourself or whatever. That wouldn't make any sense. And yeah, that does suck. Forgetting the goddamn medkit. I forgot the medkit the other fucking day. A morpho had to remind me. She's like, uh, dude, you forgot your medkit. I'm like, yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, we won this round. Obviously. <laughs> I'm, I'm the one that's playing. You see what happens when you throw a grenade right at your feet? You get the kill. And I'm, you know what? I'm tired of being a little bitch. I'm gonna go right in here, and I'm gonna. Okay, please tell me that I'm gonna run into somebody with this power. Oh God, what a waste! Are you serious? One guy, maybe two. Oh baby. Oh three, three people, motherfuckers. Hunters and titans all have crests, and you take them just the same. Good. You know what, one day, if, if if Dart never gets this game, I think I'm gonna fucking... I might just get it for the guy. I don't know. I might just send it to him and shove it right down his throat. I'm thinking about it. Because it would be cool if, he, if, if I also get people to play with me on this game as well. Evaluating shitty people to play with Criminal Juice. I jumped on three people as a hunter. What the fuck? Oh, okay. Like, like one after the other, basically? Oh, no. Please. Don't you dare. Don't you dare disconnect. I don't know why when I play Destiny 2, the disconnection is fucking crazy. That's awesome. I love, I love, I love when I... When I get to do shit like that in Left 4 Dead. When you like pounce on one person, you kill that person, then you pounce on the other, and then you pounce on the other. Lots and lots of points. But nothing is better than hitting hitting the car. Or hitting a trash can with the tank. And getting hell, hell of points. Just like an amazing amount of goddamn points. I love it. Like you said, you got like a 7300 in one shot or something like that, you said. With a car. You hit like four people or some shit. That's awesome. Awesome Blossom. So yeah, the show... The show I went to was alright. I saw like... I got there, a band was playing, they sounded alright. I made it there like at 2.30 in the middle of their show and uh, the band was pretty decent and then I went to the side ate two burritos waited for the next band so the next band was bored out of my mind went to the side again ate two burritos and I just and you know what after I ate those two burritos I just stayed there I'm like you know what for the next band I'm not even gonna get up to be honest with you I'm just gonna sit here and if they sound good I'll get up because a lot, a lot of those bands sounded the same. That's why I was like, come on, man. Why you guys all sound the same? 
Stop sounding the same, goddammit. Fucking boring. Do 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 Yeah 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 yeah. Same fucking music over and over again. You gained the lead. Oh shit. And my friend funny thing is, my friend um he literally invited me to the show. And the show was two to six o'clock. He got there at four thirty. <laughs> so <laughs> that's fucking so stupid behind. you invite me but you get there two hours and a half late that's hilarious the best part of the show was after the show was done when we got to go hang out and talk to each other and stuff I haven't hung out with someone in like I don't know like three months or so about three months the only people I hang out with is uh, people in uh, Twitch, which is actually good enough for me. Good enough for me. Just like that Deftone song, uh, Hole in the Earth. Just like he says in that song where he says, I hate all my friends. Yep. My new friends, the new friends I'm making on Twitch, they're actually awesome. They're, they're more awesome than the people I know in real life. <laughs> like the people that I actually get to see physically in real life. People I'm meeting on Twitch are way better. And one day I hope to meet um, the, the people I, I I met on Twitch. I know, I, I feel like I will. I will. Hopefully, hopefully on, on the TwitchCon, like I said, I could fly some people out to go with me. That would be pretty cool. I would really like to do that. And we all dress up like uh, Left 4 Dead characters and shit. I'm Zoe. I, you know, I, I called it already. So, Dart said he wa he's gonna be um, the hunter. So, he's lucky he's not he's not going to be the spitter because I would be all over him. Like seriously, I'm already all over him. But if he if he if he dressed up as a spitter, I couldn't contain myself. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't. I can't. The the spitter is just too attractive for me. Sorry. That motherfucker tried to get me with that with that shit. Let me see, do I ever have I never have Fuck man, I know there's someone behind me shooting me as well. Fucking bastards. Remember, put your shield on, you dumb fuck. I always forget to put my goddamn shield on before I go out to battle. Yeah, I saw you. I saw you. Creeping up, you stupid son of a bitch. Guy swears I didn't see him coming up from that way. Oh, thank you for the shield. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. I tried. You know what, dude? This will maybe help me out. Okay. Fuck you. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so the show, whatever. Uh, what else happened? Oh yeah, and I got and I got pissed off again after the show because I was sitting in the dumb 14th Street. I was sitting in the park where you can go sit or whatever. And uh, I, I, once again, I see two little cute kids selling Oreos. It just pisses me off, man. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong Nothing with the ghetto left. community and these single mothers that fucking make their children little boys at nighttime working, selling Oreos? I get it. Oh, they're cute. They're going to buy the Oreos. But um, how about you take them to have a good time? How about you work and you let the kids have a good time? Not put your two little cute children to work for you. 
while you're in the background just watching them and probably treat them like complete shit too that's how it is in the ghetto community you don't even treat them good for doing work for you that's fucking annoying man i can't stand it i hate i hate ghetto people and that's all there is to it but i don't hate there's nothing wrong with 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 if you grow up in your ghetto but you're still a good person i actually know ghetto people that are good people so when i say i hate ghetto people i mean the ghetto people that are just horrible people which is usually are let's have a fight yeah yeah fights and money and and murder and uh fuck fuck you stupid ass fucking people it makes me sick to my goddamn stomach and fuck you ghetto girls that get weaves on your goddamn head as well disgusting disgusting with your hair hat nice hair hat you got going there nice stinky 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 hair hat <laughs> that you got on your head nasty fuck you gained the lead i'm afraid of those grenades so i'm not gonna get anywhere near them yes we gained the lead but i'm not running into anyone that I can face right now. I ran into him. God damn it. I got a I got a I got a strike as a charger. What do you mean a strike? LOL. What do you mean a strike? You mean you 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 mean you punched them or something? Oh! Bold all four survivors down. That's what I... That shit is so hard to do, but you're so good as the charger. Uh, for some reason, the charger is, is so cool, but for like I said, me and the charger connect, will never be friends, uh, unfortunately. Unfortunately, we will never be friends. That's what it seems like. Uh, that's the only th person I have a, a big problem issue with is the charger Is not might don't be my friend That's what I every time I play with dart I always pay attention to his what he does in, with the With the charger the way he spawns and and just charges I Pay attention believe me. I want to get good with the charger. That's the only person I got a problem with <laughs> The only goddamn person that gives me really, really big issues. Huge issues. Yeah, this music is uh, very calm, very, very calm, calming. Hey, Dart, I know you don't want to fucking, I know you hate Destiny for some odd reason, but uh, you know what? I'm not going to bother you all the time about getting Destiny 2, but I will always bother you every time I see you to get Left 4 Dead 1. No excuse. No excuse, buddy. <gasps> you can get that shit for like five dollars. I know you can. I still wanna wanna get you to experience Left 4 Dead Part One, cause you're such a goddamn hater, Dart. Stop hating on Left 4 Dead One. And that game, oh my goodness, there will there will there will be no close. No close scores if you play with me in that game. There will be no close scores. It'll be a win always. I care. I guarantee it, dude. I'm not even kidding. I guarantee no, never a loss. Never. Oh yeah, I was gonna ask you. Uh, Control. <clears throat> what do you think about that kid? That came in the other day. Show me you can take uh, roll, roll Robbie or whatever. What do you think of him? He was being so odd.
Zone B captured. You I'll, I'll probably, um... <laughs> if he gets online, maybe I'll invite him to the game. I'll, I'll maybe I'll invite him maybe to uh to play if he gets on later. You captured Zone C. You have advanced. And and, and by the way, my stomach still hurts. Zone B Just so everybody knows out there, the pizza and milk still is bu bubbling in my goddamn stomach. Still bubbling in my goddamn stomach. Still bubbling. That was, I think, honestly, that was the worst. That was probably the worst uh, thing I've ever eaten. Uh, yeah, I think so. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to put that as number one on my list. Dipping pizza into a cup of milk. Probably the worst thing I've ever had in my life. Biggest stomach ache I've ever had as well. Well, not the biggest stomach ache, but... Because I'm sure I've had a bigger stomach ache. <laughs> I try to dodge him. The other day, oh yeah, he's kind of weird and cool. I fucking got kicked. Don't you, don't you hate when you get kicked and you're doing really, really good work? That's what I'm saying. Why do you think I want to have a lot of people that I play with? I'm happy that you always play with me on Left 4 Dead 2. Because then me and you can kick people that are fucking suck. Or... No one could ever kick me or you out because we're both there together. I hate getting kicked and I'm actually doing, always try my best and they kick you for no reason. And then they leave the shitty players on the team. <laughs> That's hilarious. This is the last uh, round I'm doing. So after this round, it's time. Oh shit, he got that. I still Zone A lost. I know there's someone hiding around here. You know what you can stay right there, buddy. I'm gonna go for Zone A. Zone B. I just saw this motherfucker you fly by advantage. me. Can't wait for the frustration on Left 4 Dead 2. Um, uh, which is gonna be right after this <laughs> right after this round. I hope I hope I end the stream on, on a good note. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you, dude. That's a power play. You took them. Now hold. Come on, dude. Come right out. Come right out. You want to come and fight? Come out and fight. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. How many times do I have to give someone a high five so they can die? How many high fives? Fucking pieces of shit. After this round, it's time for oh shit, criminal juice. <laughs> 2017. <laughs> I love that Dart always quotes everything. And I love when Dart adds a person's Sometimes I'll say something and he'll add someone else's name on there as a quote. Which is like the weirdest shit ever. He so always... <laughs> you have I love I love when he does those quotes. <laughs> oh my god. Zone A lost. This is. Zone B captured. You have zone advantage. Oh my goodness. You gave the lead. Okay, that's what I'm trying to do is gain the leads. The leads. I want to go to the leads festival. The leads festival is awesome. Zone A captured. Power play. Keep the pressure on. Dart is from Britain, so I would like his BBC. He should understand what I mean by I would I would want his BBC because BBC is a is a broadcast in in London, so the BBC. Ah yes, now show them the true meaning of war. Okay. I'll show them the true meaning of war. So Shut the Three fuck up, man. Minutes. Don't tell me what the fuck to do. I want to show them the true meaning of bisexuality. That's what I want to show them. 
Oh shit, the game is way too close. Big beautiful cheese. Yeah, that's what BBC. I want your big beautiful cheese. Zone B lost. <laughs> that's what I that's exactly what it is. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out. Please get out. All right, all right, all right. Oh, hell no. Hell no. You want to be super? I can be super. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, you know, sometimes when you want to be cool, it just doesn't work sometimes. All right. Forget about that one. Forget about what came out of my mouth just now. I don't know if they're here. Are you serious? Are you serious? All of a sudden they jumped to 58? What in the fuck is my team doing? Seriously, what what is my team doing? Honestly. I left my grenade there. I left my grenade right there to kill you. There you go, get the score back up. I can't, can't end the stream on a loss, okay? Get your shit together, team. Don't worry, I'm coming right this way, dude. Don't you worry about it. Okay. I love when when I think my teammate is my enemy. That shit is wonderful. One minute. Time to prove yourself. Zone B Who lost. cares about the zones, man? Fuck zone the zones. We gotta the actually kill people. People have to actually die for us to win. Fuck! You had a shield, that son of a bitch. 64 to 64. Oh my goodness. From a tower with oh, our powers man. combined, I am Captain Planet right now. I am Captain Planet right now. I don't give a shit. I don't I don't like pollution. I don't like pollution. I'm gonna get rid of it right now. You wanna know what the pollution is? The people that we're playing against. Let me get rid of it. I am Captain Fucking Planet. Oh my god, are you serious? Who cares about capturing? We gotta actually kill. Killing. Kill people. I'm the only one that gives a fuck. Oh my god, man. The best thing about being a guardian is you're never truly beaten. Shut the fuck up. The best, the best thing about being a guardian and you're never truly beaten. Shut the fuck. Fuck up with your corny shit. Shut up. I don't need to hear it. Hate that old man with his old man voice. The best part about dying is that you come back to... I don't need to hear that. Okay? It doesn't make me feel better when I die in Destiny 2 and then the old man comes out of nowhere. You know, dying isn't so bad. Shut the fuck up. I don't care. Fuck off. Now I'm gonna... If you think... Okay. Now it's time... The funny part is that this is my chill game. This is the game that makes me calm. Now I'm gonna go to Left 4 Dead 2 where I'm really going to explode. But at least I have Dart to play with me. So let me put Dart on the screen so you can see the cool shit he does. I, I haven't read it yet. Let me see. Um, he says, who cares about the zones? We need to kill people in order to fuck. <laughs> That's my quotes right there. <laughs> That's what he does. I, I love that. Oh, 69, eh? Yep, 69, baby. Me and you. <laughs> All right. Um, going to Left 4 Dead 2 now. And we're going to scream. That's the, that's, that's the real game right there. The real frustration station right there so i like to have the ambient music in the background you know while i say goodbye and uh off to left for the two um hold on a second okay criminal juice for the blind i am saying this out loud because if you're blind i'm saying it out loud that's why i'm saying criminal juice out loud why would i say that for the deaf, 
if you're deaf, some sign language for you. It's not proper sign language, but you know, my lips, my beautiful shiny lips move for you. For those that actually have eyeballs like Dart, that can actually see, including glasses, you look down here and you can see my name. And if you can't read, let me know and I'll teach you how to read on stream. And I know one day some, some, someone's gonna, gonna say that to me. They're gonna be like, I can't read. And they probably will know how to read, but I'm still gonna show them either way. Yeah. Gotta throw my pillow over there because I'm gonna go. Hi, Snoopy, how are you today? You're fine? Thank you so much for answering my questions, even though you're not real. You're real in my head though, Snoopy, so it doesn't really fucking matter now, does it? As long as it's real in here, that's all that matters. Uh, yeah. 